Hey everybody, this is Pastor Lincoln here. Just wanted to tell you guys, we wish you all a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Don't forget, in 2020, our theme verse, 1 Thessalonians 5.11, build each other up and encourage each other. Let's all make it a point to encourage and build up the body of Christ. The last thing we need is to tear each other down. Ladies and gentlemen, we love you at Calvary Baptist and thank you and have a very Merry Christmas. The baby, the baby Jesus, he was in Bethlehem because uh, baby Jesus was cold and he didn't have a blanket so Mary just told him. God, God was looking for baby um, girls and he chose Mary. An angel came down and said to her that she's having a baby. There was Mary and Joseph. An angel came to Mary and told her that she will be pregnant with the Son of God. Tomorrow's baby Jesus says birthday and then um the an the angel appeared to Mary and and then the angel said um uh, Mary is gonna have a baby and his name was baby Jesus. Baby Jesus was born in Bethlehem in an inn, or no, he was born in the manger because... Baby Jesus was born in, in a, Baby Jesus was born in, in, in a, in a, in a stable. Uh, so, um, um, uh. Christmas is the story about Jesus. Mary was folding laundry, just doing her everyday normal thing. But then an angel came and told her that she was going to have a baby, the Son of God. He was born in a manger because all the inns were filled and his mom, who's Mary, was pregnant and they were trying to get an inn, but they couldn't because they were all full. So he was born in a manger, in a barn. Um, so there was a Virgin Mary, and the angel um, came to her and said, you're gonna have a baby and you're gonna call him Jesus. So Mary was doing her laundry, and an angel appeared to her and said, you're gonna have a baby and you're gonna name him Jesus. So Jesus was a, wait, no, I messed up. <laughs> so. The king, who's the king? <laughs> who's the king? Um, that Mary had baby Jesus. An angel came down and told her that she was going to have baby Jesus, or Jesus. An angel came to Mary and said that she was going to have a baby and she had to name it Jesus, and then um, while Joseph was sleeping, an angel told him in his dream that um, Mary was not lying, that she would have a baby. And then they went to Bethlehem because um, Joseph had to do something, I forgot. The story of Christmas was about when Jesus was a baby, um, an angel told Mary that she was going to have a baby, and then she had a baby Jesus, and Jesus, he was, aw, can I start over? Christmas is the story about Jesus. Mary was folding laundry, just doing her everyday normal thing, but then an angel came and told her that she was going to have a baby, the Son of God. And she happened to marry Joseph, and so since they wanted to do a census, they had to go back to where Joseph was born from, which was Bethlehem. But then they couldn't find any room in the inns because they were all packed and stuff. So they had to go in a stable. So Je Jesus was born, Jesus was born in a manger. Um, so an angel came down to Mary and Mary, and the angel said to Mary that, don't be afraid, you're going to have a baby boy. What do I say? What am I supposed to say? Where do I start? I don't know. He was born. 
<laughs> Wait, what do I say? She had the baby and named it Jesus. <laughs> Wait, no. There was the she went so she had to go back to Bethlehem because that's where Joseph was born. Oh no, was it Bethlehem? Oh yeah, yeah. And then um they couldn't find a house, so they had to go in a manger because all the houses and inn thingies were taken up and then um and then the star, the wise men followed and they brought baby Jesus gold, frankincense, and myrrh. And then the baby was born and the baby, um, yeah. So then they went to, well, they were born, I, Jesus was born in a manger because there was no room in the inn. And the wise men brought him gold, myrrh, and frankincense. All the inns were taking up, and King Herod um, wanted to kill him because there couldn't be any more baby boys because he wanted to be the um, the only king. Um, Jesus, he was born in a manger in Bethlehem, in the city of David, and then there was three wise men that came to him years after he was born though, and is that all? Oh yeah, and then, wait, was it Herod? It was Herod, right? And then Herod tried to kill baby Jesus because he wanted to be the only king, and he, Jesus was going to be the king, so he got really mad. He sent the wise man down to get to kill the baby, but they didn't kill the baby. They brought the baby gifts. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The wise men, when they saw baby Jesus, they brought gold, silver, jewels, and coins. Uh, the wise men came to see baby Jesus, and they gave him three gifts, gold, frankincense, and myrrh. So when Jesus was about to be born, there is the wise men, which followed the star and went for Jesus and gave him gifts. That's all. To King Harold asked, looking for the baby Jesus and King Harold got mad. So he sent to kill all the newborn baby boys. And um, yeah, that's all I remember. And then there was wise men, and they followed a star, and then they went to go stop at King's, I forgot his name. And then um, he told him, he told the wise men, um, tell me where this baby is so I can come and worship him. And um, then they followed the star and they brought, and then when they got there, they had these presents and they were um, gold, frankincense, and myrrh, so I think that was that. Uh, the wise men, they brought him gifts and they were coming because they were following the stars and they, um, they brought gifts. What gifts? Uh, frankincense, and I don't remember the rest. And the wise men came with them, and they followed the star. And also, baby Jesus got presents for them, and the angel was there too. And that's all I know. Uh, the wise men came to see baby Jesus and they gave him three gifts, gold, frankincense, and myrrh. And um, when baby Jesus was born, wise men um, came, gave him jewels, gold. They, he was born in a stable and there was a lot of animals, and then that's all I know. There was baby Jesus born, 
And then the wise men, the wise men came with myrrh, frankincense, and gold. Um, the angel told the wise men not to go tell and report news back to the king because the king wanted to kill baby Jesus. And that's it. Mom, Dad, thank you for everything you've done. And thank you for everything that you've gotten me and for the shelter and food. And um, that you buy me clothes and electronics and stuff like that. And thank you. Mom, Dad, Merry Christmas. Mom, Dad, Merry Christmas. I love you, Daddy. I love you, Dad and Mom. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Mommy and Daddy. Merry Christmas, Mommy and Daddy. Merry Christmas, Mom and Dad, and a Happy New Year. Um, Mom and Dad, I'm thankful for you and all you've done this year for me, and I appreciate it. Merry Christmas. Happy Merry Christmas, Mommy and Daddy. Mom, Dad, thank you for all that you do for me. Merry Christmas. Mom, Dad, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Um, I want to thank my family, the Gallegos family, for everything that they've done for me and bringing me for this, to this school. I'm very thankful. Merry Christmas. Christmas for me is about, um, it's not about the gifts, it's about um, Jesus' birth and the gifts are just something that's added on. Christmas for me is not about the trees, the presents, the decorations, but it's more about spending time with Christ and your family. For me, Christmas is about spending time with each other and fellowshipping, just getting to know one another better and just hanging out and stuff with your family and friends. Um, Calvary, have a good Christmas this year and remember to spend time with your family, not electronics, and it's not all about a presence. Merry Christmas. I'm thankful for Pastor Lincoln for giving me a chance here to come to this school and be a part of the family. Merry Christmas. Mom, Dad, I love you. Have a Merry Christmas. Mommy, Daddy, I love you and thank you for everything. Merry Christmas, Mom and Dad, I love you. Um, thank you, Mom and Dad, for being a good Mom and Dad, and thank you for loving me and caring for me, and I love you, Mom and Dad. Merry Christmas. Mom, Dad, thank you for everything that you've done for me. Thank you for the food that you've given me and the home that you have bought for me and yourselves. Uh, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Uh, hi, Mom and Dad. Um, thank you for everything you've done and Merry Christmas. Mom and Dad, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Calvary, thank you so much. You've just been such a great support to me. You all are like my family. I really appreciate for all the help you have given me and that hopefully you will flourish and grow more. Um, Christmas is not about present. It's about baby Jesus' birthday. And the wise men, when it was baby Jesus when he was born, they gave him gold and jewels. Mom, Dad, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, Mom. <laughs>